Good morning, everyone. How are you all? I know you all are doing very well, right? Yes. Okay. So many a times, ma'am, your mother, your father, or even your grandparents tell you many stories. Yes. And we listen to it very carefully. We enjoy it. We love listening to them, right? So today also, ma'am will going to tell you a story and let's see what it is about, what we're going to learn from it. Okay. So what you can see on the screen, it is a rainbow. And what comes to our mind when we think of rainbow? Yes, colors. We think about the seven colors that are there in a rainbow. So today we are going to learn how many colors are there. What are the name of those colors, right? Okay. So the name of the story is Maria and the Rainbow. Maria and the Rainbow. Maria woke up after a long nap. So Maria was sleeping and when she woke up, she was surprised to see a wonderful rainbow outside her window. So when she peeped outside the window of her room, she saw a wonderful rainbow. We all enjoy watching rainbow, right? Because rainbow has so beautiful, attractive colors. She started imagining. How many colors she could paint with one, with each one of the seven colors. So she started imagining that what I can draw with the seven colors of the rainbow. So how many colors are there in a rainbow? Seven. How many colors? Seven. So she has started imagining what I can draw. Like if there is red color. What we can draw with red color, we can draw tomatoes, we can draw strawberries and much more things, right? So Maria quickly looked for a notebook and the pencils that her mother had given her for her birthday and she started drawing. So her mother gifted her color pencils on her birthday. Your mother, your father, or grandparents, or your relatives give you gifts, right? On your birthday. So, Maria has also got the gift on her birthday as pencil colors and a notebook. She made a big heart in the middle. She drew apples, strawberries, tomatoes, watermelons, cherries, and all the things that reminded her of her grandparents, grandmother's garden. So first color is red. And with red color, she drew a big heart. So what is the color of heart? Red. And then she drew apples inside it, strawberries, tomatoes, watermelons, cherries, and all the things that she has seen in her grandmother's garden. So when she went to her grandmother, she saw her garden and there were many red things in her garden and she drew those things. So first color is red. Next is orange. So what? let's see what she has drawn with red, uh, orange color. She remembered the town square where there is a big orange tree. And also the carrots and pumpkins. And she used to buy, that she used to buy on Sunday mornings with her grandmother. So on every Sunday morning, she used to go to the market with her grandmother. And there she saw orange tree, carrot and pumpkins. And then comes yellow color. She drew the sun's rays and everything that reminded her of summer. So in summer, there is sun shining very bright and, it, and lemons and sunflowers, bees and the little chicks that used to walk her, walk by her side. So she drew 
lemon, sunflower, suns, bees, little chicks, which are of yellow color. And if I want to draw anything of yellow color, I would draw my favorite fruit, mango. And what you will draw? Yes, you can draw bananas also. That is of yellow color. And even you can draw your favorite yellow dress or yellow car or any of your favorite yellow toys. So she has drawn lemon, sunflower, bees and little chicks. So first came red, then orange, yellow. Let's see the next color now. It is green. Then when she changed the pencil she was using, she remembered the frogs that used to cluck in the pond as well as the clovers and the caterpillars that used to live in the garden of her house. So what, what does frog say? Frog says cluck, cluck, cluck. And do you know what are clovers? Clovers are flowers which has three leaves only, three petals, okay? And a, flower, a clover with four petals, if a clover has four petals, it is called as lucky flower, okay? So now we all know what are clovers. Clovers is a flower with three petals. And if it is, has the fourth one, if it has four petals, so it is called a lucky flower. Okay, now let's see the next color. Blue. The aroma blown by the wind reminded her of the holidays at the beach. The sand in her feet, the blue swimsuit, the kite flying away, the ball, also the shovel. Okay, so in summer vacations, when we go to the beach or for our holidays, she went to the beach. Where did Maria go? She went to the beach and she drew the blue swimsuit. Her blue, the swimsuit she was wearing was blue. So she has drawn the blue swimsuit, the beach, the water, the kites, and the blue ball. Okay. And next color is indigo. And before the rainbow disappeared, she painted the sky with stars and a boat in the horizon with the sail colored in indigo, right? So she has drawn a sky with stars and a boat in the horizon. Horizon, what is horizon when sun is uh, almost light uh, was setting okay the sun when the sun sets and night comes so she drew the stars and the moon and the indigo sky next is last one is violet and it is a shade of purple color so she since she's a small girl she knew that color as purple and it is also called a violet color so finally, after a long struggle with the violet color, because there are very few things that are of violet color. So she has drawn lavenders blooming in green spring. So lavenders are also a flower. It is also a flower. So she she could imagine of that. Uh, she could imagine that flower which is of violet colors, right? So. We have read about the seven colors and the colors are violet, e, indigo, b, blue, g, green, j, yellow, o, orange, and r, red. So again, what is the word? The word is web, girl, v, violet, e, indigo, b, blue, G green, J yellow, O orange, R red. Okay, so let us all, now mom is sharing the screen and let us all draw our own rainbow. So what we need for the rainbow, different colors and a white sheet or your drawing file. 
and marker or even crayons you can take. So here is my drawing file and let's open a fresh page in the, your file. Okay. And let's start drawing our rainbow. So first, what we will draw, we will draw blue, take a blue crayon and draw clouds, okay? So draw, start drawing the clouds on both the side of the sheet. So draw the two clouds here on both the ends of the sheet like mom has drawn, okay? And afterwards you can color them also, okay? So which is the first color of the web girl? Violet, so what mom will take the violet color, we'll dip my finger in the violet color and we'll do the printing, fingerprinting to make her rainbow, okay? So do the fingerprinting like this with the violet color, okay? And which is the next color? The next color is green. So I'll take the green color, will dip my finger in it. Sorry, but I forgot. Next color is not green and you have not told me. So which is the next color? What? It is indigo. So I'll take the indigo color, open it and dip my finger in it. And again, we'll do the fingerprint like this. Okay. So violet, indigo and b, -E -B. so b is blue. So but is blue so i'll open the blue color dip my finger in it and i'll do the blue color now okay so now we'll print the blue color so here comes the blue color b e b g G is, now comes the color green, right? So I'm going to put the green color now. Okay, next is yellow, yellow. So mom is going to open yellow color and we're going to do the yellow print. So we're going to do the yellow print now. So yellow is here. Next is orange color. So here comes the orange color, right? So now we're going to put orange color. Oh, it's got dirty. Okay, so here comes the orange color. So you have to be careful while printing, okay? Because it may get... Okay, and the last is red color. So we're going to put red color now. So let's dip our finger in red color. And we're going to put the red color. Okay. So here is the rainbow. We have all made our rainbows, right? And you can make the smiley clouds also you even despite coloring them instead of coloring them you can make the smiling cloud
clouds also. So ma'am is making the clouds smiling. So our rainbow is ready. So what we have learned today, we have learned the seven colors of the rainbow and new word vibgyor. So vibgyor includes the seven colors of the rainbow, violet, indigo, blue, green, yellow, orange and red. And we have learned a new word that is clovers. Clovers are the flowers with three petals. And if it has four petals, it is a lucky flower. We have learned a new word, lavenders. Lavenders is also a lavender is also a flower. Okay. So we all will remember these words now. Ma'am will going to ask you next time. Okay. So it is time to say bye-bye and mom will see you in next class now. Bye-bye everyone.